What is going on guys? It's Will and welcome to another video. In this video today I'm actually going to be doing a kind of vlog. Hopefully you guys are going to like it. Today we're going to be shooting a woodcutter. We're going to be able to cut him in on the revenue from this shoot through the power of black box which uh, I think is really really cool. I'm going to have to grab some fuel and some coffee before I get there. Hopefully you guys are going to like learn quite a lot from this video. I think it's going to be really cool to sort of share how my workflow looks like when I'm out in the field. Uh, but yeah guys without further ado let's get straight into it. Hi guys, just picked up the coffee now. We've got some fuel as well. We're ready to go in a minute. I'm just gonna get my coffee down quickly, but uh, it's going pretty well this morning. Uh, hopefully everything's gonna go well with the guy. We're about halfway there now. But uh, yeah, I really need to get a front car camera to actually get some decent B-roll at the front if I'm gonna be doing this regularly, but you guys are gonna have to forgive me on that front, I'm afraid. What is going on guys? I've just turned up here now in the car park. We're just waiting for him to turn up. Hopefully he's gonna arrive here soon, but I've just arrived in this little village. Uh, you can probably see in the background here, just sort of looking in the viewfinder, that it's quite foggy. Um, I think it's probably gonna clear up. I don't know if it will, but it'll be interesting to see whether it gives the footage more of a cinematic feel or whether it's actually just not really gonna be good. But you know, it's gonna clear up later in the day in case it's not, but it'll be good to see what it looks like. I'm quite hyped to get into this. I think it's gonna be really cool to show you guys exactly what I do. I'm excited to show you guys exactly what my workflow is gonna look like. But again, my one problem is that I am here on my own. And the problem with that is of course that, you know, I'm gonna be trying to vlog and shoot stock at the same time. So I'm not gonna be able to vlog as much as I would like, but I am gonna be able to use some of the content that I get while I shoot stock actually in this vlog. So. Hopefully you guys are gonna to get to see some of my workflow, some of the shots that I'm creating here. And I'm gonna try and vlog sort of in between getting shots as well so you guys can kind of get an idea of what I'm doing. But I hope you guys enjoy that and uh, yeah, let's get on with the video. Okay guys, so we've just turned up at location now. Uh, we're just gonna start unpacking the kit and then we're gonna start filming. So hopefully this is gonna go really well. You guys are gonna see some really cool footage and uh, hopefully you know, we're gonna get some really good stock out of this. It's still very foggy down here, but hopefully that's gonna clear up real soon. But anyway, yeah, let's get into it.
it's going really well so far. Um, got some good stuff with the drone, but unfortunately the mist has been quite hindering towards the actual filming. But now the sun's starting to help disperse the mist a bit. But even now, you see, we've just taken a break and there's still really good stock opportunities. We're about to fill up the chainsaws with fuel, so I'm hopefully going to get some there. And uh, we're just going to carry on and keep going. It is worth noting as well, of course, that we're on a live site here, so you do have to be mindful when you are shooting this kind of thing. But uh, other than that, yeah, it's going really well. So that's us done here now guys, uh, the trees finally come down which is good. Got some good shots which of course you guys have seen a couple of them, sadly I didn't get the uh, aerial I wanted with the tree coming down but yeah it's just a good opportunity as well because I think I'll be able to do some more hopefully in the future. Hopefully get another chance at getting an aerial shot of a tree coming down because I think that's probably quite a good shot for stock footage especially if we can get it in 4k with the drone. But yeah, that pretty much wraps it up at this location. I'm going to start thinking about heading back now, but didn't get as much as I was hoping to, but obviously that's just the nature of working on a live site. We're not here exactly to shoot stock footage. It's just part and parcel of, you know, working on a live site. And of course we have to operate around what they're doing. We can't obviously hold anything up and that's just is what it is. Um, really happy with how it's gone though. Got some good stuff. Hopefully gonna get some more on my way back past a few cinematic areas. I might have an opportunity there, but we're just gonna have to sort of take it as it comes, but I'm very happy with how it's all come out. And uh, yeah, I've just got to start packing stuff up now really, and uh, it's been quite good. Hopefully gonna get an opportunity to shoot some more. Uh, I think it's gone very well today, and obviously this guy does it as a job, so good opportunity there for me to sort of come back out with him in the future. And uh, yeah, we'll hopefully be doing some more real soon. Mm -hmm.